हेलो एवरीवन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट कार्बोनाइल ग्रुप स्ट्रक्चर और यू कैन से स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ कार्बोनाइल ग्रुप आई कैन रिप्रेजेंट द कार्बोनाइल ग्रुप इन दिस वे सी डबल बॉन्डो एंड दिस कार्बन इज फर्दर अटैच्ड विद टू अदर कार्बन चेन नाउ हियर वी कम अक्रॉस डेट दिस कार्बन इज हैविंग एस पी टू हाइब्रोडाइजेशन we can found this sp2 hybridization in this way as we can just see that number of atoms uh, attached to it here it will be 1 2 and 3 so three atoms are attached three other atoms are attached plus number of lone pair we find that in this structure no lone pair is present so zero lone pair so it will be uh, your three and three three num this number three indicate that it is having sp2 hybridization so here it will be uh, three sp2 hybridized orbital are produced so uh, these three high sp2 hybridized orbitals uh, which are produced having same energy having same energy sp2 hybridized orbitals always form sigma bond this sp2 hybridized orbitals always form sigma bond which bond sigma bond i can show this representation here uh, as c double bond oxygen single bond single bond with the carbon chain this carbon single bond with alkyl chain that is sigma bond carbon with al alkyl chain that will be single bond that is sigma bond and here one sigma bond and one pi bond i can show the representation uh, with orbital representation carbon oxygen then uh, here it will be uh, a bond representation from the carbon side it will be a bond representation and further it will be a bond representation from the uh, long chain of whatever the long chain possibly forming forming a sigma bond here sigma bond here and here it will be a sigma bond so so oxygen will be having p orbital oxygen will be having p orbital this uh, is sp2 hybridized orbital sp2 hybridized orbital this one is sp2 orbital this one also represent sp2 orbital here the bond angle is 120 degree here the bond angle is 120 degree uh, what about the structure of carbonyl group uh, the structure uh, it is trigonal planar the structure of uh, carbonyl group is trigonal planar now if i want to represent pi bond formation here i can show uh, in this way it will be uh, carbon single bond oxygen this bond uh, i have to represent p orbital for oxygen and carbon p orbital uh, for carbon so it is forming a 120 degree angle here a 120 degree angle here and a 120 degree angle here this bond is a, your sigma bond and this bond represent your pi bond so it is pi bond formation so one thing come across so we have come across that all the sigma bond all the sigma bonds formed all the sigma bond formed are in a same plane are in a same plane one thing is very common that all the sigma bond formed are in the same plane